Yo, what's up guys? I'm going to be doing a video tonight about Michael Jackson, about his innocence and about him being the greatest entertainer in the world and and about his um, death hoax. This is what I'm going to get done first, is the death hoax. The death hoax of Michael Jackson is he alive or is he dead? We need to know because Michael Jackson is at state right now with his um this leaving documentary crap. And if he's alive, he should be out and def defending himself. And as well, on the last back then the last days of Michael Jackson back then, when Michael Jackson left the voice recording on Dr. Murray's phone saying what he wanted to say. He wanted to build a children's hospice. He wanted the fans to know that he was the greatest entertainer in the world. And he just, he loved his fans. And let's get back to where if Michael Jackson is alive or not. It's been 10 years almost, and if Michael Jackson is alive, which everybody does believe he is alive, there's proof, evidence, everything. It would be good to know if the Jackson family can fight back in some way on Michael's behalf to fight back on the documentary, but Michael Jackson never has to show or hear from himself personally because he's in a quiet private life if he did fake his death because he's the greatest entertainer in the world and he said that in that recording in the Michael and Dr. Murray's uh, phone and that was on May 10th 2009 just a month before his death and the, the, the only thing that really annoys me is on YouTube right now of Michael Jackson's videos it's like all they're showing is leaving documentary, leaving documentary, leaving documentary, leaving documentary, leaving documentary. And they're all over one hour, two hours on video. And they're not even real videos. They're fakes. Do you know? It's just music playing the whole way through it. I just think it's a waste of people's time. Because they haven't got nothing better else to do in their lives. They'd rather do shit like that. And I have heard, I have seen on Google that uh, in London, in UK and London, they're going to take down the Michael Jackson uh, Innocent poster on the buses in London. I mean, what the hell is going on? Trying to stop his music, taking down his statues, taking down his innocence. What the hell is going on here? This needs to be settled and over and done with. He needs to rest he needs to just he just wants to live in peace he just wants to have a quiet life with his family if he's alive will that ne will we are never ever never ever gonna know or not if he is alive we're never gonna know if he is alive and well and safe the only thing we can do is follow the clues and ever and all that there that's all we can do because fans are very good at spotting things like that out. And so is Pear. I think her name is Pear Jr. And she's done the Alive Daka. She's done the Alive videos 1, 2 and 3 Michael Jackson. And there's ultimate proof there that Michael is alive and well. But we need to know. If he's alive. And we would love to know if he's alive and well. Some way but you know only some people can know and find out. And he, and, and he was the greatest entertainer in the world. And Michael Jackson is 100% innocent. It's just too clear. And the facts don't lie. People do. And this is the thing. They need to do this quick. Because if they leave it anymore. Then it's going to destroy his legacy. Or try, it's trying to destroy his legacy. They're trying, but these guys are lying. Webb Robson and um, 
has the other guy who's in on it. You know, they these guys are lying. You you can even see in the video at the end the the guy those guys were sweating bullets. They were sweating. They were sweating like anything because because they were lying and maybe because they can't believe that people are actually listening and because they can't believe because the document has not was allowed to be released. That's why because when people are, are gonna ask them questions, they're gonna they're they're gonna get nervous. They're gonna they're gonna uh they're gonna um they're gonna get scared and they're it's gonna come back and hit them hard. And I think it's it, I think it's already I think it already is hitting them hard since day one because everybody knew that, you know, when Wade Robson, you know, was saying about when he came out and, you know, changed the story about him being abused, you know, he was probably lying since there, you know. He had years of planning this out. You know? But guys, that's all I have to really say in this video. I'll see you guys later. Take care. Peace out. Michael Jackson, the King of Pop, is innocent.